Welcome, welcome, hello. Today I have the Hell Vape Drop Dead with the Vandy Vape 80 Watt Pulse Squonk. And I was facing a problem with a short atomizer. I fixed it, so don't expect me to show you everything, but I'm gonna give you a brief answer to how you can fix it. Okay. So again, this is the Hell Vape Drop Dead. You're probably watching this because you have the same exact RDA with the same exact problem. So, it was working perfectly fine. Or in your case, it won't work and it keeps saying short atomizer, but your build is just perfect. First, I would start with that. Take off all your cotton. After you take out all your cotton, unscrew the RDA. Take out your squonk, your squonk pin. Clean your squonk pin. Clean as best up the hole that the squonk pin goes in. You can. As well, these wells on this side right here and on the other side, um, blow in them as hard as you can. Go like this, hard to get whatever is in there out. So the reason why you're getting a short atomizer, which is what I found the answer to, which is probably your problem as well, is when you clip the leads down here, metal got stuck in one of these spots or somewhere in the pin or something like that. So go ahead and thoroughly clean your mod, your RDA, my bad. And then screw your RDA back on. And even if you want, take out the coils. You can reuse them. I just did it. And these are the same coils. And I was just facing the short atomizer. It is not Hell Vape. If you're using the Vandy Vape or any other mod, it is not the mod. It was simply user error. So go ahead. To, if it's easier, take out the coils. Clean everything. And then put it back on. If you have no coils, it should read out. Let me show you nine. Not, I'm not gonna take it off because the video is gonna be too long. But it will show nine nine point nine nine ohms. So if it's reading nine point nine nine ohms without no build, then that means you have no more short atomizer. This is a quick video. So if you kept the coils in and you just cleaned it, it should read whatever, like mine, 0.16, it should read the amount of ohms your coils are. So, if it's, if it's still saying short atomizer with your coils in, then go to step two and take your coils out just so it's that much easier and clean it again, even if you just cleaned it. Even if you can't see anything, every little hole, even in here, like everywhere, check everywhere and just blow in it. If you need, go get air duster. Instead of going to the vape shop, they're just going to tell you to call the warranty. Don't do that. You're going to waste your time. Go get some air duster. That will save, that will save you the most time right there. Go get your air, a can of air duster and spray out the whole thing. And it, the problem will be fixed. And then, no more short atomizer. Thank you for watching. If this video helped. Go ahead and hit the thumbs up. I currently have cotton threads with some flat Claptons. I'm vaping on crisp strawberine at three nick. If you do not smoke or you do not use nicotine, do not use nicotine and it's addictive. If you are under 18 or 21 in some areas, do not vape. Vaping is not for young ones. Make smart decisions. If you'd like to see other videos like builds, um, reviews, anything, go ahead and comment. Hit the subscribe button so you can see what I post. Comment what you want to see. I will make it happen. You guys dream it. I make the vision. Thank you. Peace.